Hello, everyone. I'm Larry Ridley, and this is the NFL on EA Sports. A pair of tight ends will be on the field today looking to do whatever it takes to give their team an advantage. It's Witten Cowboys going up against Miller's Seahawks. So now let's go to Arlington, Texas, where Jim and Phil have the call. It's the NFL on EA Sports. Another exciting matchup just moments away now as we join you from AT&T Stadium. Hello, friends. Jim Nance along with Bill Sims. And, Bill, it's an absolutely gorgeous day here for football. And how will that factor into this game? Yeah, we're going to see a game that's all out. I think the coaches, they prepared all week. They devised these big game plans. And the weather's good. Now they can call any play they want on that play sheet because the elements are not going to play a factor. So it's going to be exciting. The Seahawks are back deep, ready to return the kickoff. Dan Bailey has it teed up for the opening kickoff. No return here, and Wilson will come back out at the 20. Wilson's heading on to the field. He'll be leading the Seahawks today. Well, one thing you can never say about Russell Wilson is he lacks arm strength. I think that's that's what caught a lot of people by surprise, how strong his arm is and how willing he is to throw it down the field. First and ten. Here's the handoff to Marshawn Lynch. Brought down at the 26. Hard to judge sometimes what time of possession really means in an NFL game. But I know this. When you run the football like that and you pick up decent yards, that's a good thing for the offensive side and a great thing for your football team. Lynch is in the backfield. Wilson's got it in the gun. And Richardson's got the catch and the first. That's a really good throw and catch, and they get the first down. Jim, that's what you want to do. Pick up that first down. Now you give your offense three more opportunities. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Quarters formation here for the defense. Play fake. Here's Baldwin. Gains 14. Rhythm. You hear it so often in sports, and it is true, especially on the offensive side. That's another first down by the offense. They got some rhythm, and these kind of these kind of drives usually lead to scores. Intercepted. That brings the play to an end. And here comes number nine. Tony Romo taking the field for the first time. Tony Romo, probably one of the top five quarterbacks when it comes to movement in the pocket. He moves around and slides to find an extra time to throw the football. Then he's deadly with that arm. First down at the 42. Very nearly intercepted. As we take a look at this offense, you'll be seeing him running and receiving today a number of times, and that is running back DeMarco Murray. Yeah, DeMarco Murray has just been a solid NFL player ever since he's come into this league. From the University of Oklahoma, he's tough, big, and strong. That's what you like to see out of the running back. Good job that time by the quarterback. Man-to-man -man coverage down the field. When you see it, you've got to be accurate with the football. He was that time, and that's why we got the completion. First down here after the completion. After the long game, let's see what they do here. Murray trying to power his way right up the middle. Ball is out. He's brought down. A recovery by the defense. That's what you call a takeaway. The defense just makes such a hard hit. 
that they take the football away from the offense. Hold on a minute. They're going to stop play and take another look at that last one. So they're looking to see if the ball came out before the knee was down. I think when you look at these plays, most of the time it's pretty easy to determine. Uh, Jim, you know, you can, it's just always a clear shot. When that knee hits the ground, you can freeze that shot and determine if it's a fumble or After down by contact. Play, the ruling on the field is reversed. This one had to be instigated by the folks upstairs. They challenged the call on the field, and in fact, it was the proper thing to do. The play is overturned. After nearly turning it over, it's second down. DeMarco Murray is in the backfield. They run the counter play. They'll mark him at the 22. Running backs, they love counter runs. They know when a defense has been over-pursuing, so they make that fake one way, and when they cut it back, there's usually a great running lane there. First down here after the run. Romo is going to be in the pistol here. Screen complete to Williams. Wagner's the one who brings him to the ground. That pass just illustrates what everybody talks about. That is touch. When you can float the ball over the defender into the offensive player's hands, that takes a lot of talent. Bryant's lined up in the slot. Second and short. They'll go ground. Middle. Murray's hit and brought down. Yeah, the defense gives up the first down that time inside the red zone. But there's only so many things the offense can do. Let's see if they can hold them. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. The defense comes out in the nickel. They hand it off to him again. And game maybe four. The defensive line will be the focus here in this game. If they're disrupting the quarterback, the rest of the defense will have a chance to do their thing. This will be second down. Ready to make the stop on the goal line. Loading up that defensive front. He'll get it again. Takes it across. It is a touchdown. Good job that time by the offense. Scoring that touchdown and putting him ahead. And when you get ahead in the football game, the National Football League, it makes you relax and you play better. The Cowboys lined up now for the point after. Makes the PAT. The Cowboys offense is on the sideline right now, bathing in the moment after putting up points, but it's the defense that really made the difference there, setting up the score with the fumble recovery. Baldwin's going to test the coverage this time. And the tackle's made right around the 25-yard line. They face first down. Wilson's got everybody split out wide. From the shotgun. And this is dropped. Here's the starting offense with a receiving core that can be so dangerous in a game like this. Second down following that incompletion. Offense lines up here. Wilson keeps it, throws to the right. He brings it in here, and he's got the first. When you play man-to-man -man against this receiver, you're going to have a tough time. 
quarterback's a good thrower. Really hard for a defensive back to stay with him. One quarter complete, and we'll take a break as you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. First down here. Two tight ends on the field here. Lynch is going to take the handoff now. And he is tackled at the 44. When you're going against a really athletic defense, there's nothing like reverses and the counter run game because they see it, they go, and you counter it, and that's why it works to perfection. Split backfield here. The Seahawks have it at the 44. The Seahawks get a first down. The quarterbacks and receivers in this NFL now are so good. It's so easy for them to throw and catch and just keep picking up those first downs. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. On this passing down, the defense comes out in the nickel. Wilson from the shotgun. He makes the catch. Taken down a yard short of the first. Well, when you keep chipping away with these short throws, sooner or later, that defense is going to come up. And when they come up, that's when you throw it over the top. Following that completion, second and short. Wide receivers are bunched up. Wilson's going to take it from the gun. And he's thrown to the ground. Well, the quarterback's got to see this blitz when it's coming. And if he checks to an audible to get rid of the football quicker or give himself extra protection, that will help him a lot. Third down now. The Cowboys lined up in the nickel. Russell Wilson will take it from the gun. He's looking to the right here on this throw. This is what separates offensive lines in the NFL in obvious passing situations like this one on third down. Can you hold up and protect your quarterback to give him time to make those throws? Well, the answer to this one right now is no. are ready to take over now as their offense heads onto the field. Romo's setting up now in the Get pistol. Ready. Ready. First and ten. Romo to Bryant. Sherman's in on the tackle. I used to love it when I threw those short passes, uh, screen plays, whatever, and you get a long run after the catch. Shoot. Looks good in the stat sheet. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Murray's lined up now as the running back behind the quarterback. To the ground, middle. Hobbles there to make the tackle. Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. Romo lines Let's up go. in the pistol. The Cowboys take it from the 38. DeMarco Murray gets the handoff, and he is brought down at the 39. Good coaching on the defensive side. Everybody stays at home. They stay in their gap, and they hold that run to a short game. The defense looking for one more stop here on third down after that run. Two-minute warning looms, and this may be the last play before it hits. They feed it to him one more time. The tackle's made, and the first down is picked up. Two-minute warning.
coming up at the half. It's the Verizon Halftime Report. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Murray's lined up directly behind the quarterback here. It's Witten, and they advance the ball onto the other side of the field. Anytime you picked up a couple first downs, here's what happens. The defense starts to doubt what they're doing, but maybe more importantly, it gets those big boys over there tired. First down here after the completion. Romo's lining up in the pistol. Looking to go up top again on first down. Romo connects with Williams. The slant round is not used as much as it used to be in the NFL because defensive linemen read quarterbacks now better than ever, and they jump up to knock those passes down. But that time they didn't get it done. The slant round is caught and comes up a couple yards short of a first down. And the give now to DeMarco Murray. And that's good for only a yard or two. Murray is able to show everybody why he should get the football more. Good job that time finding his way and picking up a first down. First down here after the run. Murray's lined up behind his quarterback as the single back. Looks to his left. Romo connects with Williams. The best way to keep the other offense uh, on the sidelines is just keep marching down the field and picking up those first downs. What a good job by the offense. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Nickel formation for the defense here. Murray taking it right up the middle for about four. That was a power running play that time by the offense. It picked up some good yards. Nothing like it. Show the defense you're willing to get in there and slug it out and get some tough running yards. From the six. Another carry here. Murray's hit and brought down. It's getting harder and harder in the NFL to score when you're this close to the goal line. So what will the offense do? They, they better be creative. That's all I know. The long drive continues. So that's going to do it for the first half. Cowboys are up in this one. This is the Verizon Halftime Report. I'm Larry Ridley. Let's get ready now to take a look back at the first half. Both teams have had their moments so far today, and that's why we have a tight game on our hands. We'll have to see if either side can take control in the second half. All right, here we go. Let's take a look at some of the highlights from the first half. After the pick, offense comes out now. Beasley's got the catch in traffic, and he'll eventually be brought down, but not before getting to the 37-yard line. Offense on the field now after the pick. The ball's going to come out on the run. He'll pick up only a few yards here. Offense on the field now after the fumble. He'll head up the middle on the run, and this four-play drive goes for a touchdown. That puts them up by a touchdown. Hauschka will be sending this one down towards the end zone to get the second half started. Harris elects to run it out. Cowboys come to the line to start this drive at the 24. Now first and 10. Play action fake. Looking to throw. Has his man. That was a nice job by the offense. It just puts him in a better position. Nice little throw and catch.
The pass play was good for five. Second and five coming up. Offense lines up here. DeMarco Murray gets the handoff. Brought down just two yards shy of the first down marker. You got to give a lot of credit to the defense. They were all over the run that time, and they only give up a short game. The Cowboys from the 32. Murray's taking the handoff. Shuts off the first hit. Keeps churning ahead. A big chunk of yardage gained by DeMarco Murray. That's what you want to do. Get a first down while you're on top and keep that clock moving and just controlling the football game. Good job by the offense managing things so far here today. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Tony Romo will take it right from the center. Has his target. And the tackle is made at the 41. Well, it's not quite a first down, but a good read, good throws, good catch. And a lot of good there, isn't it, Jim? But nice job by the offense. Now they got second and short. Look out. Who knows what the next play is going to be? Offense lines up here. The Cowboys snap it at the 41. And now here's Murray on the toss. Taking off. How about that run? Touchdown. When you have speed at the running back position, you can take ordinary plays and make them spectacular. And that's what they did this past time. It was an ordinary run, but the running back got a little daylight and able to outrun everybody for the long touchdown run. The Cowboys for the point after. Add the extra point. The kick is good. The Cowboys did a great job on the ground on that last drive, putting up over 60 rushing yards. Cowboys will be kicking off. He'll take it from the 10. And he's tackled right at the 30-yard line after that return. First down, offense readying for the snap. Marshawn Lynch is in the backfield. Handoff made. Can't find space, and this will be a loss of one on the play. Got to give the defense some credit. On first down, there's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped. After running it, it's second down. Richardson's going to get set in the slot for this snap. Wilson from the shotgun. The defense gets a sack. Well, you see it all the time. When the offensive line can't stop the defensive pass rush, then you have your running backs hit a defensive lineman before they go out for the pass. That big-time sack pushes him back into a third and 14. Offense lines up here. Wilson's going to take the snap from the shotgun. And they sack him on third down. And they force the quick three and out. What a good scheme that time by the defense. They confuse the offense. They blitz. They don't know who to pick up. And how about the defender? They must love this. Coming in free and gets a good clean shot on the QB and gets a sack. And it'll be Ryan back to punt. Harris got it now. He's taken down at the 30.
they come to the line of scrimmage. First down. Split backfield here. He'll fire it out to the left. Oh, it almost picked off that time. Every quarterback in the NFL is going to have one or two passes a game that can be picked off. Most of the time, they're dropped. And this time, that was a bad drop by the defense. Split backfield here. Second and ten. Has his target. Tackle's made, and the first down is picked up. Well, when you got four defensive backs playing deep, you are going to have a lot of wide open space underneath. We saw at that time another easy completion for the quarterback and receiver. The Cowboys line up, split backfield. From the gun, Romo. He's got the catch. He's taken down at the 42. Nothing like picking up a big chunk of yardage with the perfect lob pass over the defense right into the hands of the receiver. That was awesome. Offense lines up here. Second down and 10. And the give now to DeMarco Murray. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. They came out here in the first half and established the run, and they haven't let up since halftime. They haven't. We have a very good run offensive line out here today. We got a really good running back, and the coaches, they kept giving the running back the football, and they are getting it done. So three quarters in the books, and you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. The Cowboys offense has switched sides now and has the football as we begin the fourth quarter. They're able to move the chains after that last run. quarter underway now with this snap. Tony Romo uncorks the long pass. Did not get both feet down. They went for the home run ball there, Phil, but just could not make the play. Yeah, you want to do this. You always want to throw the football deep at least four or five times a game because you want to make the defensive backs uncomfortable. If you let them get comfortable, they'll start jumping those short ones. These guys won't do that anymore now. Second and ten. Murray's going to secure the handoff. They'll mark him at the 40. The Cowboys have stayed with the run game today, and it's been a big part of their game plan. Murray's been absolutely brilliant and almost impossible to bring down. What a dominating performance by this offense today, just coming out and out hitting the defense, giving the running back opportunities, and they are taking advantage of it. Tony Romo will take it right from the center. The Cowboys will take the snap from the 40. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. <laughs> Bailey set now to attempt the field goal. The kick is good. The kick is good from downtown. Never take it for granted. When you're trying a field goal, a lot of things could go wrong. But good execution that time by the offense and a good kick. Three points. The Seahawks are set to return the kickoff. Baldwin's got it on the return. Able to move past the 20 and brought down at the 23. The Seahawks are set for their next possession. First down at the 23. They're going to get him here for a sack. 
Well, you expect defensive ends to get sacks because they come around the outside. But when you get pressure from the inside and the defensive tackle gets a sack, that's just an added bonus. And here we have second down. Wilson's back in shotgun formation. Had it for a moment, but then lost it on the hit. Good timing by the defensive player that time. He gets to the receiver just as the football is getting there and makes the hit, knocks that football loose. From the gun, Russell Wilson ready for the snap. From the gun. Looking to the right side and throwing. And he hauls it in. The defensive coordinators love this situation, don't they? Third and long, they can do just about anything, and it's going to work, and they stop the offense that time. John Ryan will be called on to send this one down the field. Harris has got a chance this time. That'll stop the play right there. The Cowboys come on to the field for their next series. Let's go. Tony Romo will take it right from the center. First down and 10. Out to the left. Romo dumps it off to Murray. Tackled right around midfield. When you can't hit the quarterback or put pressure on him, there's not much you're going to get done then. That time, quarterback had time and throws it down the field for another completion. Murray's lined up as the single back. Second down and 10. And they bring him down at the 44-yard line. When you run the football like this and you show toughness, there is no doubt when you fake it and try to throw the football down the field, the quarterback's going to have all day to get it done. This is third down. Murray running right through the trenches. Tackles made and got to move the chain. I think the coach on the sidelines, he's going to be happy with every first down because he knows that's more time off the clock. When you're up like this, multiple scores in the second half, every first down just puts the odds in your favor of winning this game. This will probably be the last play before the two-minute warning here in the final quarter. Romo's pass will be incomplete this time. We've hit two-minute warning in the second half. After the incomplete pass, it brings up second down. DeMarco Murray gets the handoff. Murray's hit and brought down. Nothing like a good trap play. When you play defensive linemen who like to get up the field a little too quick, let them get up the field, have a pulling guard, knock them out, and then run in there behind them and get those yards. Murray lined up in the backfield. The Cowboys snap it at the 31. Brings it in. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. When a defense is down, it's in the fourth quarter. you got to be a little more aggressive than that. You just can't let the offense come out here and dink and dunk it. They give up a short pass that time. Offense still on the field here on fourth down, needing three for the first. Tony Romo will take it right from the center. 
The Cowboys have it at the 29. And the give now to DeMarco Murray. That's a missed opportunity, and now they'll have to bring out the defense. Good job by the defense. Their team is down. It's in the second half, and the opposing offense, what do they do? They go for it on fourth down. You are ready for the play. You make the stop. That'll turn things around. Wilson standing back in the shotgun, ready for the snap. Can't hold on here as this goes incomplete. Jim, when you look at drop passes in the NFL, it's almost always for the same reason. They take their eyes off the football, the receivers, just before it gets there. And when you do that, that little bit of lack of concentration will cause you to drop the pass. Wilson set. Everybody emptied out for this snap. Second and ten. Here's Baldwin. And picked up about four. The Seahawks signal for a timeout. They have two remaining. Third down on the way. And Richardson's lined up now as a slot receiver. Wilson's got it in the gun. Jarring hit that time. Knocks the ball free. That's interesting as you watch the receiver trying to make a catch. He knew the defender was close, so he didn't put all of his heart into it. The defender made a nice hit and knocks the football out to the ground. Harris from the 25. And he's going to be tackled right around the 37. Cowboys are set now for their next possession. Tony Romo will take it right from the center. The Cowboys from the 37. Almost intercepted that time. Well, the defense has to be depressed after that play because when you get a chance to get off the field, get a turnover, and get the offense off the field, man, you got to take advantage of situations like that. Cowboys from the 37. Murray's handed the football. They get to him just in time. One yard shy of the first down. What that run does, it just puts the offense in a good situation. So a good, positive run. Offense lines up here. Third and one. And that's Thomas who almost had the pick. Well, Jim, I threw a lot of passes like that in my career where it should have been intercepted and the guy dropped it and you just go, yes, I got a break. Now can you capitalize on that break? They're in punting formation. Well, Phil, I enjoyed watching the game with you, and how about a final thought about that victory? Well, you know, Jim, I wish I could say the same that I enjoyed spending these last three hours with you, but that's just not the case. But, no, I'm just kidding, of course. Nice win. They got to feel good about what they've done and uh, uh, celebrate a little time. I think I'll see you next week, maybe. truly was. For Phil Sims, Danielle Bellini, and Larry Ridley, Jim Nance saying so long for now, and we leave you with the GMC Never Say Never moment of the game.